Just east of El Paso lies sacred ground. Waco Tanks, a state park with the history of humankind here for all to see. Ancient pictographs painted on these rocks dating back hundreds, if not thousands of years. There really is no other place like Waco Tanks um, in terms of the, the nature and the number of the pictograph images. And for a tiny place of only 860 acres, there's just an amazing number of, of separate pictograph sites. Unfortunately, vandals damaged several pictographs with graffiti. The thought was they could never be restored back to their original glory. Yep, I'm okay. That is, until now. Scientists have a theory, and they are here to put it to the test. This is the key to analyzing the graffiti, a Raman spectrometer. What we want to do is to use the uh, chemical information to ablate off the H and C and not touch the yellow of the pictograph. And the chemical information that we get from the Raman spectrometer allows us to do just that. Did you catch that? They can figure out what the paint's made out of with this machine. So later, they can use a laser to remove just the paint and leave behind the original pictograph. So move just a, a fraction to, the, to your right, just a very, very small amount to the right. Not, very nice. Good, oh, excellent, oh, really good, oh, okay. Yeah. You ca captured that, Daniel? Yep. We need to understand first what's there before we can address a removal process. Very, very little to your left. The removal process has to be safe, and in order to make sure that it is safe, this is to analyze what we have on the stone. To see the laser in action, tune in to Texas Parks and Wildlife Television the week of October 21st through the 27th.